All right, so I'm doing a game chair update again. This time I'm changing almost everything on this chair. This is gonna be gone, that's gonna be going. This whole little amp thing, that's gonna be gone. Those speakers up here are gonna be gone. These cases are gonna be gone, I'm not gonna have covers. And uh, I'm working on getting the upholstery off right now. So far I got most of the staples out, I got, um, if I can find my other bag, I got a staple for a new, putting new staples in. I got some fabric to match the back because this fabric got all messed up right there and it looks like crap, honestly. Um, <clears throat> I got some tools to get it taken apart and I got a new switch that lights up. I thought that was going to be pretty cool. I still need to figure out how I'm gonna fix that hole in there. I'm gonna, I'm trying to get some full shit that matches this stuff. It's like a fake leather. So I can just maybe like put a piece of wood in here and like glue it in there or something or screw it and then just put some fabric over that and then just drill a hole for this little rocker switch or. Yeah, illuminated round rocker switch. And then after that, <clears throat> I'm gonna be putting amps in here for a car. They're, they're only 20 bucks and they're like 100 watts, so even if they're not 100 watts because they're only 20 bucks, I don't care. They're going to power my speakers nice. I got these speakers right here that are going to be going in the chair. These black ones, um, I'm thinking about putting on the side, like right there and maybe like right there. Maybe I'll, whoops, drop it. Maybe I'll put one right there and another one right there. But here's what I got. I got these from Parts Express. They're actually really nice. Um... Really nice four ohm speakers. They're pretty small, but they're gonna do the job. And I'm surprised at these how big the magnets are on them. I mean, these are only like five, six bucks at the most. And here's my smallest one right here. It's got a foam surround, and it, it, it's gonna work nice. I mean, it doesn't have to be super crazy. This one's got a rubber surround. If my camera can focus, ah, uh, whatever. And the magnet's got a magnet shield on it, so. That's for like if you're putting it close to your TV, which I'm not going to be doing, so it doesn't really matter. So I got two of those ones, two of these slightly bigger ones, and then these ones I'm thinking about putting on the top because they got kind of like that, uh, if you can see that in there, it's kind of like a white or, yeah, it's a white speaker. I'm thinking about putting these ones there because they'll kind of match and they look a little better than just having this square, squared edge on them. And these ones have a huge magnet on them compared to the other ones, I mean... I just set it up right there. Here's another one compared to it. Oh, sticking. And then here's the other one with a magnet cover on it. I mean, these things are just huge magnets. And I think these ones were like the $6 ones, which was actually a great deal. I'm, I'm kind of... I should have gotten more, actually, but it's going to be good for what I need. And then for the back, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with that. I'm thinking about... Because if you look at it, that's the box. It's going from there to there and it's got that little port in there I'm thinking about taking that out and then if I can just making a new box out of this whole back because the bigger the box um, it, it the better for a ported and I want to go ported <clears throat> I might do a ported and a sealed like go half and half but I'm not sure I might just make a box from like right here um, this little post right here to Maybe like right here, just make it a little bit bigger and maybe put two subs in it instead of just the crappy one that was in there. I mean, I did um, replace this sub that was in there with this one right here that I got out of my old uh, surround sound. But this one is obviously, honestly crap. I mean, it doesn't have any terminals on it. They all broke off. Uh, camera won't focus in. And then dust cap is all crap. It's falling apart and then just doesn't look good. The whole thing is falling apart. It's got a nice magnet on it though, and it's only uh, 20 watts, so. And then, um, I was thinking back when I went to Parts Express before and I got this speaker. This is an 8 inch, and I was thinking about just putting that on the back. Not, well, it's not going to fit in there like that, obviously, but I was thinking about putting it on the back. Or maybe um, these 5 inches I also got from Parts Express. I thought those looked look pretty cool and they got the rubber surround on them. I thought that was pretty cool looking. 
I'm still not sure what I'm going to do with the sub yet, but once I get my amps in, I'm going to work on taking the upholstery off of the bottom side, and maybe um, somehow figuring out how I can get the amps in there. And then i got to get a cooling fan because those are Class A, B amps, and if you didn't know, those amps get um, more hot than the Class D amps, but they also put out better sound clarity, which is going to be good for gaming. And I just... I'm just working on getting this upholstery teared apart. Gotta get these little three watt speakers out with those pieces of junk. And uh, then I'll be on a roll with this thing. Oh yeah, I'm, I don't know about LEDs yet. I got um, these one LED strips from Sylvania. I just get them. These ones, uh, which is actually I want to go Sylvania, I'd probably get them off of eBay because they're all going to do the same thing and they're all going to run off of 12 volts. So all you got to do is get yourself a 12 volt power source from like Radio Shack or something and you can power these up, you know they got, they're labeled right there. You can't really see but it's positive, RGB, red, green, blue and then got those little pins right there you just connect your wires up to that and then you can have your colors, whatever color you want. I was thinking about putting them on the side like this. Uh, not the side, but the back like this. But I, I don't even know if I'm going to do lights anymore. I might even put them on the bottom, make it look like it has neons or something. I'm not sure yet. But once I get this all teared apart, I'll have a bigger idea in my head of what I want to do with it. So I'm going to get uh, on that right away and then keep you guys updated.